The story of Rattan Tata's biggest revenge on Ford. In 1991, Rattan Tata became the chairman of the Tata Group. Tata Motors were India's largest truck maker in India. In 1998, Rattan Tata decided to focus on building modern passenger cars. At the end of the year 1998, Tata Motors launched Tata Indica. Tata Indica was the first modern car ever to be designed by an Indian company. It was Rattan Tata's dream project. He worked day and night to make his dream come true. But when the car was launched in the market, it was not what he had expected. The car's sale rate was so poor that the Tata Group decided to sell its car business. In 1999, Ford was interested in buying Tata's car business. They invited the Tata Group to their head office in Detroit. Rattan Tata and his team flew all the way to Detroit. The Tata and Ford officials were in a meeting for three hours. But Rattan Tata was humiliated in front of his team by the Ford chairman Bill Ford. Bill Ford told Rattan Tata, You do not know anything, why did you start the passenger car division at all? We are doing you a big favor by buying your car division. Rattan Tata just couldn't stay still after being humiliated like that. The same night he decided not to sell their car business. He flew back to Mumbai, India with his team the same night. He turned all his focus to Tata Motors. With time Tata Motors became a successful car company all over the world. By 2008, Tata Motors had the best-selling cars in the market. But on the other hand, Ford was struggling to make a profit from their sales. In 2008, Rattan Tata offered to buy the Jaguar and Land Rover series cars from Ford. Those were Ford's worst selling cars back then. And Ford was facing a huge loss because of those two cars. This time Bill Ford came with his team all the way to Mumbai, India. In the meeting, Bill Ford told Rattan Tata. You are doing us a big favor by buying JLR. Thank you. Rattan Tata could have humiliated Bill Ford just like the way he was humiliated back in 1999. But he did not do that. He came out as a bigger and better person. Today Jaguar and Land Rovers are one of the most successful selling cars of Tata Motors. Today Tata Motors is one of the biggest car companies in the world. Rattan Tata is now one of the most praised businessmen all over the world. Not only for the huge empire that he has built, but also, for his kind and humble nature. The Tata Group donates 66% of its profit to charities. Rattan Tata's story with Ford teaches us one important thing. Success is the best way of revenge.